It's officially Vlogmas, so I wrote this song. It's officially Vlogmas, grab your cameras and vlog. It's officially Vlogmas, so be prepared to watch me do it all wrong. Hi everyone, welcome back to Vlogmas. And today we're doing Vlogmas Day 5. Today is another white cookie. I don't know why I'm trying to sing. I can't do that because you've seen in the intro. Here, here you go, mister. Mer Merry Vlogmas. Merry, Merry Vlogmas. Would you like to say something to the camera? How does it taste? How does it? Do you like it? Successful Vlogmas. So I've seen a lot of vloggers do, um, uh, oh, this is how I do my makeup thing. So, I'm gonna do that too. Here we go. This is my makeup. I have a Sephora foundation, which I don't use. I don't use makeup at all. So this is gonna be very fun. Um, I have this powder makeup as well, which is uh, also Sephora. Then I have concealer by, you guessed it, Sephora. We got some powder, which is the, <laughs> just like the sample, and I, don't care about brands because it's makeup either way. So anyways, we will use my foundation. I'm not sure if it's my shade anyways. And I'm gonna use my e.l.f. foundation blurring brush. I don't know if I'm doing this right or not. Let's say it is. Oh my god, it's so not my shade. Now, we do our neck. Cause that's what I've seen YouTubers do. And that's it. But my forehead does not like this foundation, it doesn't like liquid foundation, my forehead likes powder foundation. This is Cool Sand Matte Perfection Powder Foundation. Ooh, okay, it looks fine. Now we go under our eye. This is the one I use, this one's the one I like bought. And I usually use Custard, which is a seven, and this one's a Blondie, which is a 10.5. So that's a 3.5 difference, which I hope doesn't make a big difference because if it does I'll be very sad. Now we use my powder brush which already has powder on it so I'm not gonna like dip my brush into more powder and I'm just gonna blend it all around. I'm just doing this. I'm not sure if it does anything or not but it feels pretty nice. If you're actually coming to me for a tutorial you've come to the wrong place because I don't know what I'm doing. I'm coming in with my <laughs> Guess what? Another Sephora pot. Sephora. Um, this is Shame on You blush. And then a little blush moment. <laughs> a, little, a little laughing. <laughs> we'll go in with the under the sea. I'm pretty sure this is under the sea. The Tarte 5 o'clock color splash lipstick. And look how pretty it is. Like, look. I love that. Like, it's so pretty. A little dipped up. And with another product, Hard Candy. And it's coconut flavored. I hate coconut, but this is the only one that has the lip gloss. So, it's fine. Now it's glossy. <laughs> now this also, I think, has contour. Yes, it does. And we're gonna contour bones. <laughs> so now, <clears throat> um, um, I have this controversial palette. Um, so I'm gonna do... This is not my dark shadow and yeah i'm a makeup artist i know which brushes i'm supposed to use we go up here more on the right side we did more on the left side and it looks like i'm fine and this one at the bottom wow i'm blind on this side i can't see my eyeball that looks fine to me okay and now we're gonna go in with this brush. This is the light color brush. I don't know why I was talking here. This is the light colored blur brush. And then we're going in with the white. And then maybe like a little white inner corner. Wow, that's a lot, white inner corner. So then I brush it on my pants and then smooth it out. And now we have this. Do I look professional? Do I look like a makeup artist? Morphe, call me. So now we're going on with the bitty body boo boo. I go along my the bottom of my lash, so it ends right here. So I just go. Oop. So I'm gonna stop talking now, and I'm gonna stop breathing as well. 
that's one. Now we connect it. A little, a little tiny eyeliner. Not too much, not too little. Just the perfect amount. There we go. I think that looks even. So now, when we go in with our mascara. So we have the Urban Decay Perversion. Perversion. That's what it says, that's the Urban Decay. I have really long eyelashes, so I don't think I need to curl them. There's one eyelash. Wow, that, I really don't need to curl them. Like that was like so long, and then this one's just like tiny, non-existent. This eye has, this eye has more eyelashes, and this eye has longer eyelashes. So I need to find an even medium. So now, there is my makeup. Hello. A little moment. It doesn't look bad, you know. Could use some work. Always room for improvement. But currently, it looks fine. Not gonna lie. What if I turn on this light? Can you see that? Look at that. And I blend it all the way down to my neck. There is my makeup. So, a little, a little close up. Look at my eyeball. I'm staring at you. Like my. Yeah, look at that. Oh, look at that. Wow. I don't know why I'm doing this. Um, I think the lipstick looks fine. No. Okay. Oh, also, I was whole, I was balancing on a whole bunch of Bath and Body Works hand sanitizers. Like, just a whole lot of hand sanitizers. Just a lot of them. And, yeah. So, <laughs> I'll see you in the next clip, maybe. I bought this eggnog. I've never had it, and why not do a little taste test? I'm not gonna put that much. Ooh, that's a lot. Let's try it. So it's not bad. Like if it, it was like melted vanilla. How much sugar does it have? 18 grams of sugar, or half a cup. So it's not that bad. This isn't half a cup, it's like a fourth. So I probably, nine grams of sugar, so not that bad. I feel like the vanilla overpowers the eggnog taste, but honestly, not bad. I give it a solid 8.59 out of 10. Not bad. Funny how we always end up in my bathroom for some reason. Hi, let me get down to your level. I think I'm gonna end it here because I have a lot of things to do and I doubt that I'm gonna keep on recording, but if I do keep on recording, let's go into the other clip. Okay, and if we didn't end up recording, that was really awkward. If we didn't end up recording, I hope you liked this video. If you did, please give it a like or subscribe. I am not forcing you to do anything, but I would very much truly appreciate it if you did because I don't know how I'm keeping track with these vlogs. I'm sorry they're short, but this is literally my life. This is literally what I do. And I hope you have a nice day, and I'll see you guys next time.